a super good morning and a happy Sunday to each and every single one of you. As you can see, the direction I'm facing at the moment is the light is not at its absolute most wonderful, but I'm here in one of the parks. I can't remember exactly what the name of this park is in the city of Granada. I might be able to update that and somehow slip it into the title of the video, but anyway. Choosing this spot because I'm surrounded by trees, and trees mean wind shelter, and wind shelter is a great thing. Some wonderful spring flowers starting to pop up behind me. So as you can see, wind shelter, great option to have when the conditions aren't the most perfect for recording and speaking about perfect for recording and sound interference behind me over there I've got a massive fountain which obviously creates its own degree of sound interference so I'm needing to increase the volume of my voice so that hopefully you can hear me beyond the sound of the fountain that's just over the next to me. And I don't know if you can really see behind me, it looks really overcast, but these clouds are all red because it's the red Kalima dust blowing in from the Sahara Desert. And the Catholic Church is due to be having a whole lot of processions happening this evening and it's due to be raining and if it rains everybody's going to be stuck under a pouring deluge of mud and those pristine white cape like outfits that are so popular in the Catholic processions around Easter are going to be not so pristinely white when the red mud of the Sahara splatters all over them. I know this might not be the most popular thing in the world to say, but should that happen, I'm sure I'll be able to record a couple of semi-viral YouTube shorts showing all these pristine white satin like hooded um, outfits getting splattered with red mud and people and seeing that the Spanish populace in general are not the greatest fans of um, getting rained on it'll probably mean that there will be scattering for shelter but anyway be that as it may what can I tell you about content creation this past week seven days 11 articles published and I'm sitting at about 95,000 words for the month today being Sunday I haven't actually added any new words today which means that probably by the time I add my words for today I'll be up at probably around about 98, 99,000 words. So which means that tomorrow, Monday, first day of the week, we'll be hitting my 100,000 word target for the week, or sorry, for the month, a week early, which means that I'll be able to swing more of my attention onto the novel writing aspect, which of which novels two and three's outlines are coming along swimmingly at the moment. Um, I'll be able to give you a whole lot more on that next week. But anyway, let me just do a 360 degree turn. There you can see Granada buildings. But we have this wonderful park with fountains, slap back, bang, in the middle of the city. And this isn't even the largest of the parks. Garcia Lorca, where I'll be doing my one mile an hour challenge. That's one of the larger parks, 
but it's certainly not the largest park here in Granada and there are plenty of parks all over the place which gives us all a chance to enjoy a certain amount of peace and tranquility in the midst of a city. Anyway, this video is already about five minutes in. What I can tell you as far as the, my target for this coming week is obviously finish off my 100,000 words for the month and once I've done that swing on to novel writing another nice little fountain here and right next to the fountain a little bit of a bench so I'm going to take a brief sit down here and have a look at can I get the light working does that work more or less anyway so as I said I'm going to be cranking out the words first to knock out up to the hundred thousand word total for for the month as far as blogging content then roll on to novel writing and hopefully get the first draft of book two finished as well as finishing the rewrite of book one so I can start getting these published because I did have a goal of publishing eight this year we're at the end of March I haven't published one yet so that's certainly a target that I'm needing to shoot for and then also I'm going to be needing to um, finish the outline and get planning as far as shooting the video that I'm going to be doing as a collaboration with Ricky the one mile an hour challenge which will be a whole lot of fun and now that the parks are starting to get flowers it's getting towards the time when it will be an ideal time to shoot the video but more of that next time let me wrap this video up finish my walk around the city of Granada and then get cranking on knocking out my word count for, for this week until we meet again probably next week Sunday although you never know with the Catholic positions happening this evening I might knock out an extra video if things get interesting and worthwhile watching anyway with that said see you next week Sunday have a good week crank out the content and let me know how it's going on your side cheers